What's good? What's going on, man? It's your boy B, and we back in this mug with another video, man. Today we got the PS5 HD camera from Sony itself, man. We're gonna be doing an unboxing, checking out the features and functions of this particular camera along with our PS5, man. Let you guys know this is really worth that $59.99 price tag Sony has in place, man. With that being said, let's get straight into this unboxing. In the box, man, we have our PlayStation camera right here, man. Comes with this long um, USB Type A cord connected to the camera itself, and you also have a uh, a manual as well. And this is pretty much what all comes inside the box. And the camera does has the button layouts inside of it as well. I'm not sure if y'all can capture that. So the Sony camera does have two wide angle lenses allowing it to capture 1080p with a built in stand allowing you to accommodate with your TV or monitor. Now the camera does have a background removal tool which we're gonna check out later on once we get to the initial setup. All right, so a few things to note, the PS5 camera is not compatible with PC or Mac. It's only compatible with the PS5 and it also does not work with uh, PlayStation VR. You have to buy a separate adapter for that. Um, as well as it does not contain a built-in microphone, which actually sucks, man. I wish it did, because the last-gen PlayStation camera did come with a built-in microphone. But they, I guess they want us to use the uh, built-in microphone that comes in the controller. So, hey, it is what it is, man. So now we're here on the PlayStation, man. Once you're on your PlayStation, all you need to do is go over here to your settings gear icon. Click on that. Scroll all the way down until you see capture and broadcast. Here we want to select broadcast and then click on our camera. Now, by default, our camera will be disabled. All you want to do is click X to enable your camera. And once you have that enabled, now you guys see me. What's going on, big fella? What's good, man? So now we have our camera on and you can adjust the size here from small to medium to large. You can also enable a clipping mask. So if you have like a green screen or something like that, um, you can get like a chroma key effect. Um, but we're not gonna set that up. Also, you have your circle cutout. That's pretty dope. Square cutout. Um, that reminds me of the PlayStation 4 right there. Um, hex cutout and auto key. So yeah. I don't don't use auto key. If you live streaming, don't use no auto key. This is a no-go. But uh definitely uh I say either the circle cutout or either the uh, chroma key if you have one or yeah whatever you do don't use the uh auto key that's we don't go out like that please don't all right man you can also flip your um camera as well from um horizontal that's pretty dope we got some effects we can add here you got the comic the pixel scan lines toy camera and the monochrome, which is pretty dope as well. Also, we can adjust our brightness here. So you select that, you know what I'm saying? Just in case we don't have enough light, it's real dark in the room, we can turn it up a little bit. We can adjust our contrast as well. And the transparency, if we have like a green screen or anything like that of that nature. And those are pretty much the settings, man. Oh, um, for the PlayStation 5 camera, man. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Definitely way more than the actual um, PS4. So they definitely upgraded from that. There you guys go, though, man. The PS5 HD camera. Is it worth the $59.99? I believe so. Um, especially if you catch it on sale, man. I, I know Black Friday and stuff like that is coming up. The different holidays. So you may catch this on sale for probably a few dollars cheaper, man. Definitely snag this. Add it to your PS5 collection, man. With that being said, appreciate you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe! Click the bell like uh, turn the notification on so you don't miss no bangers. Check out one of the vids on the screen because it's definitely a banger. I wouldn't miss it if I was you, man.